welcome 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 back to another video y'all come on in come on in friend have a seat we got us a nice little glass of wine because as auntie tab says that's my business so we gonna sip sip our little wine welcome back this is your girl jessica aka makeup my passion and we are back with my sephora haul just showing you guys what i grabbed at the sephora sale as we sip our wine and be in our vibe period okay so Without further ado, without further ado, let's get into it. Let's get into it, honey. When you see this black and white striped bag, you already know money was spent. For sure, for sure. For sure, for sure. So anyway, let's get into it. Let's get into it. I'm so excited. Um, I'm really looking forward to trying to do the Sephora sale every year. So, oh wait, you know we got to get that young thumbnail. Hold, pose, pose, pose. All right, now let's get into it. So first things first, I'm gonna pull out some of the things, some of the bigger items that I got, but let's go over this receipt, honey. First of all, why did they give me this long ass receipt? Why was this receipt this long? Okay, so we spent a nice little chunk. I wanna say we spent $228, if I'm not mistaken, but that's not including another item that we bought separately that we did actually discover at the Sephora sale. If y'all want to know what that item is, go back and watch my vlog of me shopping at Sephora for the Sephora sale. But yes, not including that item. Just what we got strictly from Sephora. Nice $228. But anyway, we move. All right, so this is the first item. If y'all don't know, now y'all know I love Glow Recipe. They're watermelon dew drops, this dew skin line I love so much. And I had to get this set because not only um, is it full size, it was a nice little bang for the buck. I really, really like um, the toner. You also get, I think, the moisturizer and the watermelon dew drops. These top tier. I love these so much. So we got that there. And like I said, they are full size. I want to say this retailed for, I should probably tell you guys how much all the different things retailed for, even though the sale is over. I may link everything down below just to kind of give you an idea. But I got the Glow Recipe Watermelon Dew Drops little collection. Top tier, top tier. Then I also grabbed the one size setting powder. So I'd already tried the translucent powder, which was which was fine, but I wanted to try the yellow, the yellow kind of butter powder. I forget the name of it, honestly, but it's the yellow tinted one. It was between this one and the Huda Beauty powder, and the Huda Beauty powder was like four dollars more and less products, so I'm like, this is just a better bang for my buck. I will say this though, if it doesn't set well under my eyes, it will be going back, for sure. But I did grab this powder. I really wanted the Till Dawn spray, but of course, it's been sold the hell out. Who knows when it's coming back, so yeah. But anyway, I grabbed the one size powder. I also grabbed my tried and trues. Y'all already know, Too Faced Born This Way. So I got the Too Faced Born This Way 24 hour matte foundation in the shade Chai. That one is my favorite. I wish it would come into focus. There we go. Come on, come into focus. So I grabbed that. And of course I also grabbed um, the Too Faced Born This Way concealers. So I grabbed my normal shade that I get, which is Chestnut, but I also grabbed, I think Biscuit, which is like a lighter shade. I'm really trying to make sure I'm gradiating my under eye really well. And one of my favorite um, makeup artists and like influencers, she uses that shade. And I really love the gradation on her makeup. So I wanted to try it. So we grabbed those couple items and then I also grabbed, if y'all don't know, now y'all know, the cream stains and the Sephora collection line are bomb. They're really inexpensive and they're a good like matte liquid lipstick. I grabbed this burnt orange color. I've been wanting a color like this all fall with like a nice brown lip. So I grabbed that. I also grabbed some face masks from the Sephora collection, the watermelon eye mask, which I've tried these before. I love these. And then this is like a dragon fruit mask. I don't think I've tried this one, but it's a vitamin, it's a vitamin mask, which I'm going to try. And that was pretty much everything that I got from Sephora. Yes, that was everything I got from Sephora. So this item, this item right here. This item right here, I did end up buying this palette. I saw it at Sephora, fell in love, okay? Like, do y'all see the swatches? So the Sephora that I was at, unfortunately, did not have it in stock. 
and yeah honey it just it, it swept me off my feet that green right th you see that green so i ended up going to denessa's website and ordering it so that's why it wasn't in this haul but now we're moving on to ancient cosmetics so i ended up i had been kind of knowing about ancient cosmetics from instagram but lately their marketing has been top tier on instagram and they got me they were having a five dollar sale on their body oils and your girl loves smelling like a snack i love smelling like cookies cakes and pies okay so i grabbed a few of their body oils i heard that they're really really good and i'm actually taught doing this voiceover after i've already tried them and i can say they are amazing and i will be continuously using them but let me at least share with you guys the three that i got so the first one that i got was this oil here and it is their it is their toasted marshmallow scent yes toasted marshmallow baby oh this oil this oil when i tell you it smells like it smells like just that i also got the caramel um butterscotch this one also smells really good and i got the strawberry shortcake it smells good but i would say out of the three that's my least favorite i would say but i'm just going to show you guys my first impression of me trying the toasted or smelling the toasted marshmallow when i tell you that toasted marshmallow honey oh it smells so good if you know me you know i love marshmallow and honey yes all parts that mess shook me when i smelled it it smells so good so 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 good i have been using the hell out of this oil i actually have it on right now and i just smell my arm <laughs> as i'm doing this voiceover but anyway we move so next was the caramel butterscotch this one too just like top tier okay you smell like you literally just came out of like a bakery like out of the oven it just i love smelling like some i love smelling like a snack period okay and then of course last but certainly not least is the strawberry shortcake and like i said this one was this one was fine it was cool it was my it doesn't stink or anything but it, i will say it's my least favorite out of the three the first two that toasted marshmallow and that butterscotch baby um, so yeah, this is my first time trying AG Cosmetics and when I tell you I'm so excited to try more. So that's pretty much the video. That was the haul. Everything that I got from Sephora. And also I threw in the things that I ordered from Ancient Cosmetics. Like I said, they were having a sale and their like oils were five bucks. So we move. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you are new to the channel, come on in, friend. Come on in. If you like a little bit of beauty, curvy girl fashion, a little bit of lifestyle, a little mommy content, this is the channel for you. Make sure you go ahead and like this video, comment down below, and most importantly, subscribe. Come and join our little beauty community and become one of our beauty citizens. So on that note, thank you guys again for watching and until the next one, bye.